Hello pet parents, Robert Semro here back at Blog Paws 2014 and I've told you there's a lot of great people. We are lucky to have one of those really special people, Laura Nativo joining us. Welcome my friend. Welcome. Thank you so much for having me. It's so good to be here. It's great to see you and I'm happy to be here at Blog Paws. Well, it is always fun to see you. What brought you out to Blog Paws? Preston Casanova and Delilah Jane thought it would be so much fun to take a road trip together and come out to meet some of our favorite people in the pet blogging world. So we're excited. There's so many great animals here, not just dogs. We've got capybaras, yes. bunnies, ferrets. So this is just a community of animal lovers and we're really grateful to be a part of it. How does social media play a role in all the different things that you do? I think social media is interesting. It's it's a blessing and a curse. I love it because it's really great to get onto Instagram or Facebook and connect with your audience and your friends and family and kind of let them know what you're up to and see what everyone else is up to. Um, I love it for that reason. I also think in our modern society, we spend so much time taking selfies and pictures of every moment and then we're like on our phones the whole time. <laughs> so I think that we've got to find a, a nice balance where we capture beautiful memories and we share them, but we also have a healthy balance of not having our phones out with us all the time. You understand? I do. That's I, like I one of my understand. like, it's like a, I don't know, I have a, I try to, when I'm here, I try to be present with whoever I'm hanging out with and just hang out with the people and the dogs. And Well, and you have so many wonderful things going on. This is a great way for all of us, Laura Nativa fans, to stay in touch with what you're doing. But we got you on camera. Let's ask you, <laughs> what have you been up to? What exciting things do you have coming up? I'm having so much fun. I've been on a TV show called Home and Family, which is on the Hallmark Channel. Um, we're on season two, and we just found out we got picked up for season three, which is excited. We got nominated for an Emmy. And um, I'm working on the show as their pet expert and dog trainer, promoting positive reinforcement training and all things pet parenting. So it's a really great platform um, to educate and hopefully inspire people at home. You get a chance to do a, a lot of different things within the pet world. Right now, what has really caught your passion? Oh my gosh, I have so many passions. You know positive reinforcement training I is do. one thing, but also I think getting good dogs out there to make a difference, to inspire people to spend more time bonding with their dogs, training their dogs, um, that has led me to get involved with PJAC, the Pet Industry Joint Advisory Council, in a movement called the Pets on Trains Act. We're hoping to make the world a more pet-friendly place. So Preston and I are working on the Pets on Trains Act. We're also doing a lot in the animal rescue world, as we have been for years. Um, and I'll let you probably, I don't know if we're talking about that. We can talk about <laughs> Animal House TV. I don't know Absolutely. who we're talking about. Absolutely. <laughs> Robert yes, and I have a little something. secret together. Yes, yes. We're, we're, we will be doing a uh, project together. So we are definitely excited about that. And you know, so many of the things that you're doing are so important because they are changing the pet world. They're changing things for the better, for not only pets, but for pet parents. How do you stay on top of it all? I'm surrounded by really good people. I feel like the best way to stay connected is to have incredible friends who you trust and respect, like yourself. Dr. Patrick Mahaney is my holistic vet. I'm very close with everyone at the American Holistic Veterinary Medical Foundation, so anytime I do anything to do with medicine or, or veterinary work, I'm not the expert, so I call on my friends who are. Um, same thing in the animal training world. I'm very close with Terry Ryan, Robin Bennett, who's here. So I try to surround myself with people who are much smarter than me, so that way any information that I share with my audience really comes from people who have been doing this for far longer than I have, and I take it as my responsibility to connect everyone at home who might be tuning into my show or listening on Facebook with the people who have been doing this for decades and I really respect them. Well, it's always a lot of fun to see you and just your whole entourage. <laughs> it's constantly growing and entertaining, so we always love that. But you know what, thank you so much. I, it is always a highlight for everybody to have you at these different events and thank you for being here at Blog Boss 2014. We really appreciate thank it. Thank you so much. Thanks for having Preston and I and supporting us and giving us an opportunity to connect with all of our friends at home. So we love you guys, stay in touch.